I'm Mary Ann Buffero, and I'd like to congratulate you on your decision to buy the Phantom Vacuum. Like you, I'm a proud owner of a Phantom Vacuum, and let me assure you that your decision to buy the Phantom Vacuum was more than just a good choice. It was a great choice. Now, I know you're anxious to try out your Phantom Vacuum, and in order to give you the best possible experience, we created this tape to show you some of the basics of how it works and a few tips on how to get the most from the Phantom Vacuum Cleaner. So, let's get started. Oh, and uh, by the way, at the end of this tape, we've added a shortened version of our TV program that you may have already seen. Well, once you're thoroughly familiar with the Phantom Vacuum and have had the experience of actually using it, feel free to pass this tape on to a friend or family member because believe me, they're going to want to know more about this vacuum that you keep talking about. So if you haven't already done this, here's the steps to unpacking and assembling your Phantom. And don't worry, because you know what? There's nothing to it. I've already removed the Phantom from the box. It slides right out on a cardboard tray, which you can use as a working surface. Now let's go through and check that everything's there. The wand tube, the Phantom body, this videotape. I guess you found the tape because you're watching it, right? A box with all the accessories inside. Now, if you have purchased the Phantom Vacuum with the HEPA filter, look for a box that looks like this. It has the filter cartridge and casing inside. We are going to show you how to put it together in just a minute. As you'll see in the TV program, the Phantom's HEPA filter has really helped a lot of people. Let's see. Oh, there's also the owner's manual, which has your warranty inside, the owner's registration card. Please be sure to fill it out. Make sure you're familiar with everything. Also, if you ordered the hose extension accessory, you'll find it inside in a plastic bag. If you didn't order the hose extension accessory or the HEPA filter, and you decide you'd like to get one or both, there is an order form in with the owner's manual. And of course, remember, if you have any questions at all about the Phantom Vacuum at any time, you can always call the toll-free customer service number that is right here on the side of the Phantom. Okay, here's how your Phantom Vacuum goes together. Follow along with me if you like. First, let's get the Phantom in an upright position. There, now listen for the click. Did you hear that? Good. Now, it might be a little stiff at first, but that's okay. I'm going to take this elastic off. You don't need that. And take the cleaning wand. There. I'm just going to put that in the hose all the way down, nice and easy. Now, attach it on and listen for the click again. There. Done. Next, unfasten the extra long power cord and wind it over the clips on the back of the machine. See this? It's an easy release clip. Just rotate it down like this, and the entire power cord comes off at once. No unrolling, and best of all, no tangles and twists. Now, if you purchase the HEPA filter option, here's how to put it on. First, if you've already taken your Phantom for a spin around your living room, remember to always unplug it before doing any work on it, okay? Then look inside the box that contains the HEPA filter casing. Inside is a direction sheet that takes you through the simple steps, and it goes like this. First, push the upright release pedal and lay the Phantom flat, just the way it came out of the box. Now, using your fingertips or a flat screwdriver or perhaps even a butter knife, 
pry off the exhaust cap starting at the front like this and working towards the back. Then we lift it off and are ready to snap on the HEPA filter casing in its place. Now we return the Phantom vacuum to the upright position. Okay? There. Oh, and by the way, the HEPA filter cartridge is already inside the casing. It will slide down over this post and then the casing clicks into place. See that? Here's how to replace the cartridge when it's time. First, remove the housing cap by rotating this lock tab and then slide the cap forward and off. Here's the cartridge. See? It has this strap on top which serves as a little handle. We'll just lift it out like this and then let's pretend we're putting in a replacement cartridge. We just take the filter cartridge and being careful not to damage the pleated filter material, push it down into the housing until it touches the bottom. Oh, by the way, there is an arrow on the top of the cartridge right here. It must face the front of the filter housing. The cap goes back on in the reverse order, making sure the front edge of the cap is engaged with the filter housing for a good seal. Put the back part down like this and rotate the lock tab back into place. You know, the word HEPA stands for High Efficiency Particulate Air. And in order to be called HEPA, a filter must remove 99.97% of all particles, all the way down to 0.3 microns in size. Now, how small is that? Well, Mohs pollen is 20 to 40 microns. Mold is 2 to 20 microns. And bacteria, 0.35 to 10 microns. So the HEPA filter is very effective if you're concerned about what your vacuum cleaner may be blowing out of its exhaust. So the next question is, how do I know when it's time to replace the HEPA filter cartridge? Well, the people at Phantom Technologies have thought of everything. Like any filter, the HEPA filter cartridge will eventually clog up and not work as well as it should. Your HEPA filter should last for over a year when the Phantom vacuum is used for normal household purposes. But when the time comes to change the cartridge, the Phantom vacuum lets you know by popping up a red indicator. When you see the red indicator, simply pop in a replacement and away you go. And by the way, when you're using the Phantom vacuum for any reason without the filter cartridge in place, it will work just fine. So don't worry. Now let's go through the installing of the onboard attachments. First, the dusting and upholstery brush goes right on the back of the HEPA filter housing on this post. If you have a model without the HEPA filter, the brush attachment goes on this post right here. Okay, now we put on the holster for the floor nozzle. It just slips down over the post on the other side of the Phantom. Make sure it's good and snug. Then the floor nozzle goes like this and the crevice tool slips right behind it over the post like this. So now I'll just go through some of the basics on how the Phantom works. I'll actually do some of the things right here for you to see and for some things I'll refer to the footage from the TV program. First, to turn it on and off, this is a tough one. You just push this round rubberized switch on. Off. When the Phantom is on, you'll begin to see dirt build up right away inside the clear collection bin. See how it swirls around? That's because of the Phantom's patented dual cyclonic technology. How does it work? Well, a good analogy is to think of your Phantom vacuum as being like the inside of your washing machine on the spin cycle. In your washer, the clothes are spun around at a high speed and the water is forced to the outside where it drains out of the washer. In the Phantom vacuum, air inside is spinning at a high speed and instead of water being thrown to the outside, like in your washing machine, dirt and dust is thrown to the outside of the collection bin where it falls to the bottom. The air then goes into a second chamber up here and spins even faster throwing out the even smaller particles of dirt and dust which fall into the inner collection chamber down here in the bottom of the collection bin. So two cyclones 
continuous cleaning power, and no bags to hassle with ever again. By the way, I know I compared the Phantom Vacuum Cyclones to your washing machine, but please don't try to use it to pick up water or any other liquid. It is not a wet vac, okay? Now another feature of the Phantom Vacuum that I love is the carrying handle. You don't even know it's there, but it's at the perfect height, perfectly balanced, no bending over, and it's rubberized inside for comfort. Go ahead and try it out. You know your Phantom Vacuum is built to last with a powerful 11 amp motor and a body made of the same type of plastic used to make professional grade power tools. Okay, we're ready to roll. First, release the Phantom from its upright lock position so we can use it as an upright. Just hold on to the handle, press the upright release pedal, and you're all set. Now, while it's running and the Phantom is in the upright cleaning position, let's convert it to a cleaning wand. Push forward on the handle with it until it clicks into the locked upright position. Now, push the wand release button, pull the handle straight up, and then pull out the cleaning wand, which is stored right down inside the hose. See how that works? Now, if we want to do some above ground cleaning, like window sills, furniture, or anything that would require the cleaning wand, we just pick out the attachment we want, the crevice tool, dusting an upholstery brush, or the floor nozzle, slip it into the end of the wand, and we're ready to go. Oh, by the way, the Phantom's onboard attachments are friction fitted, so there aren't any little tabs or spring loaded catches to wear out and break. Another great feature. My favorite attachment is the dusting brush. See how great this is for close spaces or around valuables? And look at the hose extension attachment. Remove the dusting brush, put the extension on, then put the cleaning wand back on and look at how much room you can cover, up to 17 feet away from the Phantom. And I have to tell you, the hose extension option is really something I recommend. You can do the entire stairway without that old balancing act and lifting and juggling. Once you've used this on stairs, you will never want to be without your Phantom vacuum again. And when you're vacuuming carpet, use the carpet height adjustment for different carpet thicknesses. Adjust the setting to low, medium, or high, depending on whether your carpet has low, medium, or high pile. If the Phantom is hard to push on one setting, then go up to the next higher setting. Also, your Phantom vacuum has powerful twin headlights, and the instruction book shows you the easy steps to replacing burnt out bulbs. Sometimes people forget that their Phantom has edge cleaning on both sides, so you don't have to turn it around to do the baseboards. Okay, so we've been vacuuming. Now what? Well, you may notice that your Phantom vacuums bin seems to fill up quickly. Why? Because the Phantom works incredibly hard, and you're probably picking up a lot more dirt out of your carpets and off your floor than ever before. How to get rid of it? Well, when the clear collection bin reaches this level, it's time to dump it out. And by the way, you can dump it as often as you want. Lots of folks dump it after every use. If it does get past this mark, then you will end up spilling some dirt out as you remove the bin. To empty, first make sure the Phantom Vacuum is shut off, then lock it into the upright position, and simply pull up lightly on this collection bin catch. Pull the collection bin out and down until it clears its cone. Dump it in the nearest trash receptacle. Before replacing the collection bin, it's a good idea to wipe any excess dust and dirt off the cone screen holes and then slide the collection bin back into place and push inwards until you feel the collection bin lock into place. If the collection bin is not securely in place, you will notice a definite loss of cleaning power when you start up the Phantom Vacuum. Occasionally, with your Phantom, you're going to pick up some things that you don't mean to. If you pick up an earring or a piece of jewelry, the clear collection bin lets you look easily without tearing open filthy filter bags and spreading dust and dirt all over the place. You know, I love that feature. And if you do pick up something like a sock or a napkin, the Phantom is designed to tell you when you have a blockage and it gives you several places to look to remove it. 
If you do pick up something that completely blocks the airflow, then your phantom vacuum may shut itself off to prevent damage to the motor. Now, it's highly unlikely that this will ever happen, but if it should, then let the phantom cool down for about 30 minutes, and then push this reset button. Here, it's right over here on the back. See that? Now, while you're letting it cool down, you can look for the blockage. Now, if your phantom vacuum gets a blockage, but it's not enough to shut off the motor, then you'll hear a whistling noise. That's your phantom letting you know you've picked up something that needs to be cleared out. Well, whatever you do, remember, unplug the phantom before clearing out any blockages. The first place to look is here, the rear inspection port. The instruction book shows you how to check and clear all the inspection ports, but I'll just run through it. Rotate these latches and check inside, removing any fluff, dirt, or other blockages, and close it up. It's very simple. Now, if you don't find anything in the rear inspection port, the next place to check is right up inside here. You can usually see if something's caught up in here. If you find something, simply remove it. Put the collection bin back in place and you're off. Now, try the Phantom to see if it's working. Now, you may have cleared the blockage without even knowing it. If not, well, then we make sure the Phantom vacuum is in the upright position once again. Make sure it's unplugged. Remove the collection bin and take off the lower base cover. Now, this is so simple. First, make sure the carpet height adjustment dial is in the medium or straight up and down position. Then, just take out these two screws located in the back of the bumper guard. Lift the cover up and off by tilting it towards the front, like this. Then you can take a look at this inlet for a blockage. While we're here, let's make sure and clean out the carpet brush. Remove any thread or any dirt caught up in it. Also, if your Phantom vacuum ever does need to be serviced, just call the 800 number on your Phantom and they will tell you the location of the service center nearest you. Okay, enough of that. Want to have some fun with your Phantom? First, try it out. You're not going to believe it. Then, once you feel comfortable parting with it for a few hours, take it over to your friend or neighbor's house and just drop it off. Now, don't wait for them to try it out. Just say something like, I can't stay, but you have to try this thing. Show them how to turn it on, how to release the wand and accessories, and how to dump the collection bin. Then, leave. If you don't hear from them that day, don't be surprised. It's probably because they're afraid you'll come and get the Phantom from them, and they don't want to part with it yet. Now watch your Phantom vacuum sell itself. Also, it'll help remind you that you're not crazy for loving a vacuum cleaner so much. Well, I think that's about it. Remember, if you have any questions at any time, call your Phantom customer service representative. Oh, and don't forget, a condensed version of our TV show, The Phantom Story, is on the tape right after this. So stay tuned or pass it on to a friend. And now from all your friends at Phantom Technologies and from me, Mary Ann Buffero, thanks for watching. Welcome to The Phantom Story. In today's program, we are going from the beautiful coast of Maine to the big sky country of Montana to hear about a vacuum cleaner that is winning people over wherever it goes. It has a revolutionary patented cleaning system, and we'll see how this vacuum is great news if you or one of your family members are among the 50 million Americans suffering from allergies or asthma. So join us as we hear real experiences from real people in The Phantom Story. And now, here's the host of today's program, Mart Melamek. Our journey starts here, just a few miles from Niagara Falls, at the headquarters of Phantom Technologies. Let's take a look inside. The Phantom vacuum story began when its originators challenged the traditional standards of vacuuming performance. They wanted to improve existing technology and bring the vacuum cleaner up to date. After all, in our lifetime, we've seen how things like VCRs, microwave ovens, and computers have changed our lives. So why not create a better machine to clean our homes? In all those years of research, have evolved into this, the Phantom Vacuum, which does everything a vacuum cleaner is supposed to do, and a whole lot more. Anyone looking to buy a new vacuum, do yourself a favor. Buy the Phantom. You'll love it.
If I'd have to compare this Phantom to my old vacuum cleaner, it's four times the vacuum. In fact, I'd like to give my old vacuum away. Here's how it's different. First, the Phantom vacuum uses the cleaning force of two cyclones, which allow it to maintain peak cleaning power or airflow as it operates. By using two cyclones, the Phantom vacuum can eliminate the use of paper or cloth filter bags, which can cause cleaning power to decline as they fill up. My favorite thing about the Phantom is the power. There's, there's headaches in finding filter bags. Everybody knows that. I have people from all over the state calling me for uh, vacuum bags for such and such a model and, and getting a number for this and that. And all that, those headaches are gone with the Phantom. So the Phantom vacuum delivers dirt and dust directly into a clear collection bin where you can see when it's time to empty it. See the dirt that I've gotten? And if I pick anything up that I shouldn't have picked up, I can see it right away. Next, the Phantom vacuum is really two remarkable cleaning machines in one. For carpeting or rugs, use it as an upright where its continuous peak cleaning power and specially designed beater brush separate and straighten your carpet's pile, while the continuous airflow pulls out both the lighter surface dirt and at the same time the deeply embedded dirt, sand, and grit that can build up and dramatically affect your carpet's lifespan and appearance. A friend of mine was over last week and had not been here for probably about a year. And she said, you got new carpet. And my carpet's about five years old, but using the Phantom has made it look new again. Then with the push of a button, the Phantom handle converts to a cleaning wand with the same continuous cleaning power that can tackle any task, drapes or blinds, furniture, stairs, or hard flooring. Simply take your choice of handy onboard cleaning attachments. The Phantom is an upright vacuum cleaner but the handle of it doubles as a wand. You can push a button, pop off the handle, and it's an instant hose with a wand. I have area rugs in my apartment, and um, what I really wanted was a vacuum cleaner that was going to go from the floor to the area rugs with ease and uh, the Phantom does that. And finally, the Phantom vacuum has a remarkable HEPA filter on its exhaust, which can help protect you and your family from breathing things that your old-fashioned vacuum could put back into the air. Things like pollen, mold, dust, and other household allergens, which can make life miserable. The Phantom vacuum, continuous cleaning power, two machines in one, and HEPA filtration. The first time I used the Phantom, I think one of the things that struck me was that um, this was just a quality machine. It was just so altogether, so functional, and it worked. It was sort of something out of the future, you know, a space age. Rather than relying on the filter bag as a means of removing dirt and dust from the air passing through the vacuum, the Phantom vacuum uses the airflow to create two cyclones within the collection bin. The first cyclone spins at high speed and throws the larger particles of dirt to the outside of the collection bin, where they fall to the bottom. The second cyclone spinning at much higher speeds, throws out smaller particles, which then fall into the inner collection bin. The result is an amazing vacuum, which has constant airflow or cleaning power that doesn't taper off as the collection bin begins to fill up. I think the power of the Phantom is phenomenal. Um, as the bin fills up, I do not notice any decrease in power at all. One of the neat things I really like about the Phantom is that I can take the wand instrument and suck the cobwebs and the dirt out of the vents. It is so powerful that it actually sucks from six to eight inches away. So what's it all mean? Well, from the moment you turn on your old vacuum, you're fighting a losing battle. While the Phantom vacuum maintains its high level of cleaning efficiency. Hey, I don't know about you, but if I'm gonna go through the motions of vacuuming, I wanna know my vacuum is working as well as it can the whole time. Sometimes with vacuum cleaners, you're not sure. You're vacuuming, you're going through the motions, but you're not really sure how much dirt you're, you're picking up. With the Phantom, you can see it. I think it's time we checked in with our Phantom field reporter, Mary Jo Faraci. She's been on an amazing odyssey and is bringing us her first Phantom story from Maine. Hi, everyone. We're here on the beautiful coast of Maine in the town of Wells, and I'm standing here in front of the famous Billy's Chowder House, where we've heard some fantastic reports about the Phantom. Come on, let's go inside and check it out. This is Kathy Chick. She's one of the managers here at Billy's Chowder House. How long have you been working here, Kathy? I've been here for 14 years. Wow, 14 years. Mm -hmm. And how long have you been using the Phantom? We've been using the Phantom for four months, and it's the best vacuum cleaner that we've ever used. What kind of floors do you have here? We have carpeting throughout the whole restaurant. And how does the Phantom work on these floors? It works wonderful. It gets very messy at the end of the night after a really busy day, and it just it takes half the time to mm. clean up than any other vacuum cleaner that we had before, and it's just absolutely wonderful. This is Kurt Warner. He's a waiter here at Billy's. 
What do you like best about the Phantom? It's a very powerful vacuum. It sucks up everything in its path, and that can be anything from clamshells to pieces of lobster claw. No problem whatsoever. It does a very, very thorough job. I think its streamlined design is a definite plus. Uh, it fits right into the table bases, does a really thorough job. The fact that it has uh, front lighting on it late at night when you're tired, it's midnight and you're vacuuming after a long day's work. You can see what you're doing in a dim lit dining room and you don't have to worry about the next day that it hasn't been done thoroughly. So that's the Phantom story here at Billy's Chowder House in Wells, Maine. We'll check back with Mary Jo at her next location in a few minutes. Every Phantom vacuum is made right here in North America to the highest standards, and everyone is subjected to rigorous testing to ensure its quality and performance. The Phantom vacuum is constructed of the same type of high-impact plastic used to make professional power tools, so you can be sure your Phantom vacuum cleaner can take a beating. The other vacuum cleaners, they, they're, they're soft, the, the handles uh, uh, seem to break off, and uh, with the Phantom, you can pick it up and swing it around, and and you hit baseballs with it if you want. Also, every Phantom vacuum is built with an 11 amp two-stage motor, and that means power, but you don't have to take my word for it. Listen to the people who have used it. The sucking action in the Phantom is a lot stronger than the regular vacuum. It's just incredible what it pulls out of your carpet. It's, it's unbelievable. Well, I think it's about time to check in with Mary Jo and see what she discovered on her next trip. You know, everywhere we've gone, people just love their Phantoms. And guess where we are right now? Well, we're here in the Midwest, right in the heart of Wisconsin's dairy land. This is Mary O'Brien of Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Mary, what's your favorite thing about the Phantom? It's not real heavy. It is very high powered. And so you know that it's really doing a good job. This is the greatest thing that, uh, the vacuum cleaners that I've ever seen. And I've owned a number of different kinds of vacuum cleaners. And this was the most powerful one. And yet it wasn't real heavy. Mm -hmm. And I like that about it too. Plus the attachments are right on the vacuum cleaner and you don't have to keep running around trying to find them okay. or taking this part out and putting that part in. They're just right there for you. And I really like that too. Did you trade in your Phantom for another vacuum cleaner? No. In O. <laughs> there are dozens of vacuum cleaners on the market, but I don't think there's any that can do the job that the Phantom does. And nobody's paying me to say this either. <laughs> it's really the truth. I'm sold on it. Well, this farmhouse is 152 years old. And um, when we moved into it, it was a real farmhouse. And it looked all of 152 years old. And uh, we pretty much started from sanding the floors to uh, cleaning the beams. And uh, um, it was a big job. Without the Phantom, uh, we wouldn't have been able to um, uh, do the job as easy as we did. At first, I thought our old canister just wasn't doing a good job. But we ended up giving that uh, canister away. We don't have any use for it any longer. And the people that have it are more than happy with it. They think it's a great vacuum cleaner. Well, they haven't seen the Phantom yet. <laughs> and they're not going to see our Phantom. <laughs> the other vacuum I would empty once, twice, you know, once a month, once every other month. This vacuum cleaner, I empty it every single time I use it. That shows you how much it cleans and how much my other one didn't clean. We have uh, friends that their son has allergies. And we have a dog and a cat. And uh, before we got the Phantom, he would come over and he would sneeze. And uh, they put it down to just being allergic to the animal hairs. Well, since we got the Phantom, when they come over, he doesn't seem to have a problem with the sneezing. So we must be picking up a lot more of the, uh, the animal hairs that we weren't getting with the canister vacuum. Several years ago, I learned that uh, I was allergic to house dust. And one of the things that we've discovered is that when our house is dusty, the dust gets in the carpet. And when it's in the carpet, I have trouble breathing. Hey, wait a minute. Don't say our house is dusty. Because I clean. <laughs> I clean well, I thought, until we tried the Phantom vacuum cleaner. And when we tried the Phantom vacuum cleaner, we discovered that there was a lot more <laughs> dust in the carpet than we ever dreamt. I felt terrible. Like, what have I been doing all this time? You know, I haven't been really sucking up anything with my previous vacuum cleaner. But with the Phantom, I can see what I've got, and I really think it's helped with the allergy situation. Since I've been using the Phantom vacuum cleaner, I really feel like the carpet's a lot cleaner. I like to lie down on the floor at night and watch TV, and it just feels better. I mean, that sounds funny, but it's true. It really feels cleaner. Well, this has been a fantastic trip. Everywhere we've gone, we've heard great Phantom stories from real people telling us their experiences in their own words. Now, we weren't satisfied with only hearing from people who have used the Phantom vacuum in their homes. So we took it out and let people who have never seen it before try the Phantom vacuum for the first time. 
and compared to some of the more popular conventional brands. The results? Watch. I thought it was the most remarkable machine I've ever seen. So it's a very powerful motor. Amazing. The uh, thing is, it's wonderful. I really like it, and uh, I like the look of the vacuum cleaner. It's a very good vacuum. You can drive it everywhere you want. Cleans very well. It's so good. Everyone will take advantage of it if they have the possibility to do that. Most people don't know this, but traditional filter bag vacuums can blow a tremendous amount of tiny particles, smaller than the eye can see, right out their exhaust and back into the air, where they just settle on the floor, furniture, and bedding. So what happens over time is they build up, and the more they accumulate, the more this stuff you put back into the air you breathe every time you vacuum. As an allergy sufferer, it's really important to be able to pull lint and dirt out of my carpet, but it's just as important to be able to deep clean my upholstered furniture. At night is a really bad time for me. So many times at night, I wake up in the middle of the night stopped up, can't breathe. For the past eight years, I've had asthma, and I noticed that it's really difficult to breathe, especially when it's dusty. Normal vacuum cleaners, um, it just blows it out every time you use them. You're actually repolluting your air. The Phantom Vacuum, on the other hand, has a remarkable accessory called a HEPA filter. HEPA filter works extremely well. To be certified and called HEPA, a filter must remove 99.97% of all particles passing through it all the way down to three-tenths micron. This means the HEPA filter on the exhaust of the Phantom Vacuum can remove many common household allergens. Things like house dust, pollen, mold, and fungus. Since using the Phantom, I've thoroughly cleaned my mattress, and it's made a world of difference. I sleep through the night. When I used my old vacuum sweeper, you could see the dust particles in the air from the sunlight through the front window, and I would sneeze for at least 30 minutes when I would finish vacuuming. When I vacuum with the Phantom, you don't see the particles, and I don't sneeze at all anymore. My mom got this new vacuum cleaner called the Phantom Vacuum Cleaner, and she's been using it, and I've noticed a great change in my breathing. We're going to take a quick break, and when we come back, we're going to see what happened to Mary Jo when she visited the Wild West, the big sky country of Montana. Yesterday we were in Maine, today we're in Montana. We're at Vacuum City in Haver, Montana, and boy, has this guy sold some Phantoms. You finally got the Phantom to try. What impressed you about it? Well, of course, I took it up to my own home, and a number of years before that, we had put in a central vac system, which is known for its suction, a lot of power, had a vibrating power head, and we wanted to compare the Phantom with what we had. Uh, we took it into one of the rooms that we normally, you know, vacuum pretty good, and we thought it was fairly clean, and of course, using the Phantom, we were in for a total shock. I could not believe it. I've been in the business 20 years. I was just totally mortified, is, is the word. And of course, since then, we use the Phantom ourselves in our home, no longer use the central vac. We get a lot of customers that buy Phantoms that tell us stories like this. And of course, it's hard to believe these, but my son, my daughter, never vacuumed, never vacuumed her room before. So they start to vacuum, and all of a sudden, they're seeing this dirt come up. Dog hair, cat hair, bird feathers, guinea pig pellets, God knows whatever comes out of the carpet, but all of a sudden they see this. With this type of machine, you're going to get that type of reward. In Montana, one of the things we look for is what we, co we call, and I'm sure it's across the country, word of mouth advertising. And I've never sold a product yet that's got this type of response. And when I say that, uh, you'll sell one person. And I have a lady in particular I know. She bought one. She got her daughter to buy one. She got her son to buy one, and they had a family reunion just recently, and no kidding, they came in and bought five more. Now, uh, very rarely is a relative going to tell another relative, buy this vacuum, unless it's a heck of a vacuum, because if not, you've got a family problem there. When you look at vacuums, and there are a lot of them to look at, you'll sometimes see a lot of your door-to-door -door variety vacuums sell for well over $1,000, sometimes $1,200, $1,500. But in reality, you could buy maybe two or three Phantoms for the price of one of those, and uh, you'll be getting a better vacuum with a Phantom. You know, I just went through Vacuum City and counted 68 used vacuum cleaners. Steve Burstock, the owner, tells us they were all traded in for Phantoms. Sells itself. Yeah, sells itself. Yeah. That's the best way to say it. My house is an older mobile home, and it came with long gold shade carpet. And when I first moved in, it was matted down, and I was going to replace the carpeting because it was just so bad. 
And when I got the Phantom, I ran it down the hallway and the shag just popped right up. <laughs> it's like, so I haven't, replaced, yeah, I haven't replaced the carpet. Earlier, you mentioned something about a friend of yours who borrows your Phantom all the time. What, what yeah. was that? Yes, her vacuum was broke down, so she came over and borrowed my Phantom. Well, I was raving about it, telling her how good the Phantom was. So she decided to try it. So she took it home, and I just about didn't get it back. She, her daughters liked to use it. They were excited because they could see the dirt going into the machine. And so they used it for about a week. They had my vacuum. You kept asking for it back. Yeah, bring my vacuum back. And she still borrows it. When she wants to do a good thorough housekeeping, she comes over and borrows the Phantom and goes over her carpets. Well, this has been a fantastic trip. Everywhere we've gone, we've heard great Phantom stories from real people telling their experiences in their own words. Hey, let's face it. If you want to know the truth about something, ask the people who use it. The Phantom Vacuum. Powerful, versatile, convenient. And nowadays, people, uh, they don't have really the time or the desire to go play games with their vacuum. They, they have a limited amount of time to clean. They want to go do the job. And with this Phantom, all the attachments are there, the hose, the wand. It's a, what I consider a user-friendly vacuum for the customer. We used to have two or three machines, at least two machines, one to do the carpeting and another one to do bare floors. Uh, probably the bare floor one also did uh, um, down in the crevices in the furniture and so on. Phantom does everything. A, a room can be cleaned quickly, top to bottom, furniture, ceilings, walls, with one piece of equipment. And I think that's a real time saver for the working person today. I go from the upright to the um, wand. All you do is press a button, and it um, detaches the, um, the wand from the upright vacuum cleaner, and that's you're ready to go. The Phantom Vacuum with HEPA filtration. Of all the things that I can say about the Phantom, I have to say that it is very helpful to my family because Ken and our daughter both have allergies and it has made a world of difference. You can look in that canister and you can see all that disgusting lint and dirt and I don't know what's in there and that's stuff that we're not breathing after I vacuum. I would definitely recommend this to people that have uh, potential allergy problems. The Phantom Vacuum eliminates filter bags. The number one feature that sells the Phantom for me is the, the fact that you don't have to use a filter bag and uh, that savings, right, that's money right into the customer's pocket. You can't remember what your model number was, so you think, well, that's the one, so we bought it. And I pulled out five different packages, and I said, this is it. I never want to vacuum with bags again. If you're going to vacuum, you don't run out of a bag at the last minute and find that you don't have one in stock, and you have to go over to the department store. The Phantom Vacuum, a great value. The price of the Phantom is very low for what you're getting. I find it's better to put the money into a good vacuum cleaner that lasts and has the quality and the, the durability and the performance that the, uh, the Phantom has. It's worth every single penny to have the Phantom vacuum cleaner. If I have a machine that does all that work for me, then I'll, I'll get it and the Phantom is it. From all the Phantom users across this great continent and from me, Mary Jo Faraci, hope to see you soon. Imagine the feeling of vacuuming your home and knowing that you're really getting it as clean as you can. And also imagine that at the same time, you're helping to ensure the health and well-being of yourself and your loved ones. Sound too good to be true? Well, it's not only true, it can be yours with a remarkable cleaning machine called the Phantom Vacuum that represents a real breakthrough in household cleaning. Here's why. First, the Phantom Vacuum has eliminated the use of messy, hard-to-find filter bags that begin to clog up the moment they start to fill. Instead, the Phantom uses a patented dual cyclonic cleaning system built around one of the most powerful two-stage 11-amp motors available today. The result? You get all the cleaning power you need, continuously. When you see the collection bin is full, simply release, empty, snap it back in place, and you're ready to go again. It's as simple as that. Watch this test of the Phantom on talcum powder, one of the toughest things for any vacuum to pick up. No matter how much talcum it picks up, whether it's in the upright or wand position, the Phantom never slows down. Tough and extremely durable, each Phantom is constructed of the same high-impact plastic used to make professional power tools and is designed for years of hard work. Want to clean something else while you're vacuuming the carpet? Simply push the button, release the wand, remove the attachment you want from its convenient onboard mount, and do the job while you're there. A chair, the sofa, the drapes or blinds, hard floors, just about anything. No more coming back later or searching for missing pieces. All done, put the attachment back on board and you're off. Remember that old stairway balancing act? Never again with the Phantom Vacuum. Release the wand, put on the floor nozzle, and you can clean every step and corner without moving the Phantom at all. 
Ready to go upstairs? With a conveniently mounted carrying handle at the perfect balance point, there is no awkward carrying or juggling. But there's much more to the amazing Phantom story. If you or your loved ones suffer from allergies or asthma, or if you're concerned about what you put into the air you breathe, every Phantom offered in this program comes with a high-efficiency HEPA filter on its exhaust, which can help protect you and your family from breathing things that your old-fashioned vacuum could put back into the air. Things like pollen, mold, dust, and other household allergens, which can make life miserable. The Phantom vacuum comes complete with everything you need to clean your home like never before. A 4-to-1 extension hose that gives you up to 10 feet of reach in any direction, the onboard mounted crevice tool, floor nozzle, and the dusting and upholstery brush. Also, every Phantom features a carpet height adjustment, twin headlights, wraparound bumpers, edge cleaning on both sides, a quick release cord holder, and oversized non-marring wheels for easy movement. Have a question about your Phantom? Simply call the customer service toll-free number that's on every Phantom vacuum. Take part in the Phantom Revolution. Pick up your phone and call the toll-free number on your screen. And remember, this is not just another vacuum. This is the Phantom vacuum with a cleaning force of two cyclones.